we have Roblox Royal High Drama. If you guys don't know how Roblox works, it is basically like a game, but there's games within the game. There are Roblox game devs that can make games that you play in Roblox. There's one game called Royal High, it's a very, very popular Roblox game that a lot of people like to play. So there was this tweet put out. I'm not going to be able to say their name correctly. I truly apologize. It's Cesari, RH is their Twitter handle. And they are actually a, a Royal High dev. So they said, congrats to the winners, hashtag Royal High, and tagged three winners. What this is about is about a competition this dev hosted. It is about this contest. So Cesari hosted a Royal High Cottagecore fashion contest where you can submit your outfits and the first place person will win a glimmering light halo. Second place will win 100K diamonds. Third place will win... 75k diamonds so this whole thing was streamed on their twitch account as well and yeah it's a really fun contest hosted by one of the devs i think it's a really fun way to just bring more hype and joy into the community in a game that everyone enjoys but a lot of people weren't happy about the winner choice we have this tweet from i'm not going to be able to say this correctly either Yuri Candies, I believe is how you say that. Look me dead in the eyes and tell me this contest wasn't rigged now. And they did a side by side, one photo of the first place winner and the second photo of another person's submission that they deem to be better. There's a lot of other people in the comments of the winning post stating that they also disagreed with the choice of the winners. We have this person, Kintsugi, saying, I would vote for these four, you know, putting somebody else's submission in here. We have other people saying this is high key rigged and unfair, not to say that the top three outfits are bad, but there were so many better outfits. Like the bangs on the first place outfit don't even clip properly and second place didn't even try to be original. Third place is just mid, I guess clout beats talent. Again, we can see this is the first place they're talking about like, I guess the bangs placement, the second place outfit and the third place outfit. So yeah, a lot of people were upset that the winner is this person's character or outfit because they deem it to be not good enough and not cottage core enough, which I think is like the weirdest thing ever. To be honest, this is like the weirdest thing to be complaining about. And you can see it in the comments too of Candy's post, like, or what water says, your outfit doesn't need to have every accessory on the planet to be pretty. The one on the left is simple, but that doesn't mean it's not cute. The one on the right has too much going on and it's kind of cluttered, which sort of ruins it. I get the sentiment. I also don't like how they're like putting down the person on the right to favor the person on the left. I feel like we can acknowledge that there's elements on both the designs that we like without necessarily having to put down either. That's just me though. I think it could just be a wording thing because Twitter only allows you to use such short amount of characters. Yeah. So people are saying like, do people not understand it's cottage core, not cottage girl? Why are people like dragging them? It's just really funny because so many people are mad that they didn't win a competition that what Cesare gets to select the winners for. Like even though the prompt is cottage core, it is a subjective prompt at the end of the day. You can go with like a really, really coquette version of cottage core or like a much more simpler look of cottage core and at the end of the day the winner is up to cesari's personal preference so because it is a competition they are hosting thankfully most people in the comments seem to have acknowledged this we have dewdrop saying first place eight i don't know what people are yapping about sam and she says well i'm glad most of you didn't win because those attitudes are horrendous Lol, let's be honest for a sec you wouldn't be mad if you won yourself which i absolutely agree about too i just think it's just very very ungrateful to have a competition that Cesari is hosting very, very generously where you, you know, three people get the opportunity to win some free stuff, which is great. And that's it. Like if you didn't win, you didn't win. It happens. That's life. We move on. And if you won, that's super cool. Let's hype up the winners and let's move on. And I just think this is always so interesting. I kind of had that happen too, because I hosted a talent show, right? And it was literally like a meme for a fun talent show. I am not even like Cesari in which I am qualified to judge something like Cesari is a royal high dev. So they are qualified to judge a royal high competition. I literally hosted a meme talent show and there were some narratives going around that I heard of people being upset at like how some people made it through when other people didn't. It was mainly like people in the community of the streamer. It, I don't, it wasn't like the streamer perpetuating it. It was like people that were big fans that were saying stuff being like, why did this person win? At the end of the day, I am hosting the competition and I am the judge. So therefore, if I thought your submission was funny, I was going to pass your submission through. It didn't mean that if I didn't pass you, you weren't funny. But I mean, I get to pick at the end of the day and literally I am the judge so therefore I will pick who I like or whose so video submission I liked more and that's just how competitions work and I feel like you shouldn't enter a competition if you can't accept being the loser you're literally just a sore loser and you shouldn't enter if you can't handle not winning so yeah anyways I think it's a really cool thing this is already did uh, I'm really sorry that so many people are mad about this and you know what's so sad the winner put out this tweet a cradled heart aka Cody put out this tweet hey I won Cesari's cottagecore fashion contest but a few people are claiming it isn't cottagecore 
Any tips on making accurate cottage core outfits? Why does the winner have to come out with this like tweet being like, hey, so here's my winning submission. And I know a lot of you guys didn't like it. So like, how can I make it better? That is so sad. This is such a cute little outfit. Like I don't play Royal High, but I think it looks really cute. I can see why Cesari picked it as the winning piece. I really like the color palette that this person chose with all these really pretty warm tone colors blended together. The fact that Royal High Twitter is actually kind of like bullied this person into making this tweet. And yeah, Cody says, just want to say thank you for the support and the tips on my last post. I'll be sure to use them for future outfits. And to those who gave constructive criticism feedback, thank you for not being disrespectful about it. You guys are awesome. We have Julia say, honestly, it looks really good to me. I think a lot of people think that it's all mushrooms and whimsy, but your outfit looks super cute. Yeah, like cottage core isn't just one look. You don't have to be all pink to be cottage core. You can be cottage core in a much more like different vibe. And simple doesn't mean bad either. Yeah, I had gone for a more earthy stroll in the woods type look. I didn't want to do too much whimsical feels because I feel like everybody was doing that. And that's honestly a really smart choice by Cody. I mean, submission won for a reason. It probably is because it stood out. Very, very mature person. All the love for them. Yeah, absolutely all the love for them. I really hope they're not experiencing any hate or anything for this. At the end of the day, it's a fashion contest. Fashion is subjective. Some people may look at fashion and be like, this one thing is correct and this element is incorrect. Fashion is subjective. If you like it and you think it looks good and then the person hosting the competition also likes it and thinks it looks good, all good.